Hello, ladies and gentlemen, this is Domegas, and I am starting a new project. I am starting Final Fantasy X HD Remaster. Alright, so let's uh, jump right into it. Okay, so uh, there are two standard, there are two spear grids. The standard spear grid, everyone is set on a specific path. The expert spear grid, everyone starts in the middle, and you can dictate wherever you want them to go. Like if you wanted Orin to learn Waka's abilities, or you wanted Orin to become a black mage. But I'm going to go with uh, standard, because that's a good spread. And I'm going to go with the original uh, soundtrack. All right, so let's uh, start things off. All right, so we're seeing a bunch of ruins. And we're seeing a bunch of people sitting around a fire. Now, the difference between the PS2 version and the uh, this version is you actually get to fight the Dark Aeons as well as Penance, and uh, they are ridiculously difficult. You're going to be spending probably, I want to say, over 100 hours or so um, just getting your team ready just for that last cluster of fights. Um, I've also seen people go through no sphere grid uh, challenges, which is really difficult. But uh, I hear that Square is actually um, possibly planning on doing a Final Fantasy X3. I'm not sure if they're actually going to, just like they said, oh, we're going to be doing Kingdom Hearts 3, and it's been over 10 years, so... Listen to my story. This may be our last chance. Okay, so that was just a little prelude. And now we're in a huge uh, city. And this is the city of Xanarkand. Oh, I wonder who this little kid is. All right, so that's where my house is. So now you have to talk to these kids here. Can you sign this? No prob. Okay, and the character's name is Titus. Or Titus. Alrighty. Me too! <laughs> Take it easy. Can and I have to talk to these girls. Path? Of course. Nothing to worry about. Oh, if I score a goal, I'll uh, do 
this. That will mean it was for you, okay? <laughs> what seat? He's walking the front row. Sit from the right. Got it. Well, gotta go. Cheer for me. Two, three. He just had a blitz. Hey, I, I got a game to play. Then teach us after. Maybe tonight, um, well... You can't tonight. Well, I mean... Who the heck tomorrow. is this little kid? Promise? Promise. Wow, that's a heck of a city. There's the wondrous city of Xenarkin. in a coffee shop running away from home when I heard the news. Our hero, checked, gone, vanished into thin air. <laughs> My dad must have been his biggest fan. I knew how sad he'd be. Heck, we all were that day. Zanar, I says to myself, what are you thinking? I went running straight back home. We sat up talking about Jack all night. My dad and I never talked so much. Whoa, <laughs> didn't mean to reminisce, folks. Anyway, ten years later, the Jack Memorial Cup Tournament is today. The two teams that have won through to the finals are, of course, the Abes from A East and the Duggles from C South. I know there's a lot of people out there today to see the star of the Abes. In just one year, he's become the team's number one player. He's Jack's blood and the new hope of Blitzball. What kind of super play will he show us today? Will we see his father's legendary shot? I don't think I'm the only one excited here, folks. Okay, now I'm not sure. I've never actually sat through and watched that entire transition. I don't know if it goes further than that. Make way, make way! Coming through, sorry. Hey, I'm gonna be late. Hey, let go of me. And there's a giant, there's the giant stadium for Blitzball. And there were some awesome FMV sequences in this game. And in this game, Blitzball is either one of those things you're going to love it or you're going to hate it. I personally love Blitzball. It's one of my favorite uh, minigames. And apparently our character is the star player. But unfortunately... This uh, story does not have a happy ending, and the game hasn't even started yet. What the hell is that? Oh, that guy just got knocked out. That's a hell of a movie scene. Yeah, that's... 
That's an awesome FM. This is an awesome F FMV. And there's Titus, one of Titus's techniques that he comes with the spear shot. But unfortunately, he never gets to perform it. And there goes his beloved home. Whatever the heck this thing is, destroying it. And there goes the wondrous city of Xanarkin. There we go. So we know somebody by the name of Orin. Uh, 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 uh. Huh? Uh. And now here's huh? this weird little kid again. We'll get more on him later. It begins. And Time is frozen. Don't cry. Now this is just a little prelude. We don't get any uh, exper experience or huh? spear levels, as they uh, put it in hey, this game. Wait. This way. Look. <gasps> and there's the giant thing destroying our home. We called it sin. This thing is dispatching its forces all over the city. And these are sin scales. So now I've got a weapon from Jet. My old man. Okay, so Jet is his father, the one that we saw on the poster, the uh, screen, and he wasn't too happy to uh, see a picture of him. These ones don't matter. We cut through. Okay, so now there are two overdrives that if you actually spend the time, um, you can actually get, you can get, um, Daredevil, which is going to involve you getting, uh, your health into the yellow, which if you just sit here long enough and let these things attack, um, then... You can actually do that, and you can also get another one where if you kill off one of your characters and you just sit by, um, you will get loner. After all of them. Cut the ones that matter and run. But I'm not going to spend that time because um, that takes uh, that takes quite a while. 
to get to get both of those overdrives, which those overdrives aren't even really that good. Um, it'd probably take a good 30, 45 minutes, so I'm not gonna waste that time. Um, as far as the worthwhile overdrives that we want, um, Warrior's a good one, which eventually, after you just attack enough, that'll unlock. Slayer is another one, which is after you just kill enough enemies. Okay, so here's the boss fight, which this boss fight is, uh... Very simple. Now, De Demi is one of those attacks that it takes a order of your HP. Um, now, it's just filled up one of our, our gauges, overdrives. When a character's overdrive gauge means HP MP display is full, a character may use a special unique attack once. Press left over in the command window to use overdrive. Alright, so now Bushido is, uh, Orin's. Now, Orin's has to deal with hitting a series of, uh, as you can see, hitting a series of, uh, buttons. And I'm just gonna, to I just to totally wiped out a bunch of those guys. So I just got a, uh, overkill on one of them, where if you're able to do enough damage to an enemy, either just by raw damage, or, um, there being enough HP, and then he's got Power Break, which will lower the enemy's, uh, attack. Then Overkill will give you certain items. As you fight off enemies, you will get, um, Spears, which will allow you to proceed on the, uh, Spear Grid. Uh, you'll get Power... Speed, magic, and then you'll get ability spears for uh, certain abilities. All right, one more strike uh, should do it. But yeah, as you can see, my HP is really low, but Demi is doing less and less damage as we go. For some and that should be it. Nope. All right, I just need to do one more strike. All right, there we go. All right, so now luckily what they did was after this point, they give us a save sphere. And the save sphere will, at this particular point in time, uh, allow us to save the game which I'll just, uh... Oh, jeez, I forgot how many save files I, uh... I forgot how many save files I did, holy crap. Uh... Alright, well... I will... save a new file. And I will... delete all my, um... previous ones. What are you laughing at, old man? All right. Okay, so that is indeed uh, Titus' father, checked. Huh? Give me a break, man! Okay, so we are absolutely mobbed with uh, Sin Scale. Now, this fight, uh, we actually want to attack, um, we actually want to attack that tanker item over there, but unfortunately we're not going to be able to do it. So what you want to wait for is when you see the Sin Spawn's wings start to flicker, uh, like that one there, that's the one that you want to prioritize and take out first. Bye-bye. 
because uh, his attack at this stage of the game can do a fair bit of damage. So that's why you want to hmm. prioritize. This could be bad. Okay, now we have the ability to okay. attack that thing, and that's what we want to do. Trust me, you'll see. I'm actually going to take this guy out. Overkill, nice. So that was a uh, critical hit. Okay. Let's start hacking away at this thing. Wings start to flicker. Uh, you know what? I'll actually... I'll actually take a shot. Oh, never mind. I was going to say I'll actually take a... I'll actually take a shot in order to... Uh, get the tanker further along. Spines. Alright, spines doesn't do uh, too much damage. Miss. Nice. Alright, so hopefully one more shot should, uh, should do it. Yep, there we go. Now the highway bridge we're on is getting nuked. Go. Okay, so. We just, we just made it. Alright, so now apparently we're getting sucked up into whatever this giant thing is. Orin apparently can communicate with this thing. This is it. This is your story. It all begins here. All right, so Orin gets sucked up, and since he's holding on to us. We get sucked through as well, and I wonder where the heck we're going. Hey. Hey! My old man? Okay, and apparently wherever we are... This is our home, but it's completely underwater. And here is the destroyed um, Blitz ball, Blitzball Stadium. And now there we are as a little kid. I thought about a lot of things. Like where I was, what I got myself into. I started to feel lightheaded, and then sleepy. I think I had a dream. A dream of being alone. I wanted someone, anyone, beside me. So I didn't have to feel alone anymore. Okay, so we managed to uh, make it out alive, which is uh, a very good Anybody thing. Anybody there? Alrighty, guys. Um, and 
soon as I gain control of uh, Titus, I will see you guys back on the uh, next episode. Where the heck did we end up? It's nothing but a bunch of ruins around. Alrighty guys, uh, so I'll see you on the next episode, so until then guys, see you next